So once you have saved your map and you've shared it as a public map, like this one is, you can stop for the day or you can go on to the last step. And in this one, I'm going to go to my profile again, click on the content, and we're going to create a web application that will host your map and images and content. So you're going to choose create and you're going to create an application using a template. And you're going to scroll down until you see the template that shows uh, the US and select that. And you're going to choose create web app. And this is going to be your name and you're going to use this application throughout the term. So again, put in the class, uh, the class title, Geography 141, Geography 142, and then that's all you have to put for that. You can copy this and paste it in here and choose Done. And then we want to use a tabbed interface and choose Start. This is going to be the title of your uh, web application, so you're going to choose that. Hit the Forward. And this time you want to, ch you want to link to the map that you created previously. So you're going to uh, select a map and you're going to point to the map that you want to show up in your map or in your uh, story map. Uh, we don't have any legends, we don't have any fancy stuff to put on it right now, so we're just going to choose Add. And your map shows up. Uh, I have some uh, a space here, tab space, that I can edit and add information about myself. And I can insert an image. So you can type a little introduction to yourself. Uh, I did that in Word and then uh, pasted it in and make sure that you uh, are not putting too much information about yourself. In fact, you might want to just put um, your first name uh, and the last initial and not really your whole name because these will be public on the, uh, on the internet. So I've got uh, some information about myself and now I'm going to grab a picture. So uh, I went to um, the web and I found this nice picture of the lake and I saved the image on my desktop which is full of stuff right here. So this is the picture that I want to upload. So I am going to click the camera feature, choose Upload, Browse for an image, and it is on my desktop. Oh, there's so much on my desktop. Here we go. Where did it go? Um, it is number serious. Come on. It is number one, two. Oh, where did it go? Oh, there it is. Duh. Okay. So I'm going to put that in and choose Apply. Um, this goes here. The other thing you want to be sure that you do is to uh, put in the citation. And I'll fill that out later so you can see how that is done. Anyway, um, so now I have uh, the map that I uh, created and located. I have a little bit about myself in this uh, interface. So I want to save it. Now there is a glitch here um, where the save button is covered up by this little call out learn more. So I'm going to close that. I'm going to save the map and then I'm going to share it. And again, you have to share it as public and I want you to send me this URL. 
and so you can copy that URL and um, you can paste it uh, into Moodle if you want to keep a copy for yourself so you'll have it you can paste it into a Word document so there's the little short URL that will bring you that will uh, let me read your map and your story map and then you're going to close that and that is uh, your first introduction.